in the name of Allah, the most beneficent, the most merciful. Next question is, why is the name Muhammad? Muhammad, did I say it right? Why is it mentioned so, many, so few times in the Quran? Alhamdulillah, all praise and thanks are due to Allah. The name Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, Mim Ha Mim Dal, is mentioned four times in the Quran. In these four instances, you have to go back to the language and its usage. You don't refer to someone by their name. Because whatever was done in the Quran would be done by many people. And what was happening, uh, this is a, a, an example. Uh, we find it in, in about five uh, places in the Quran where Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala talks about how people would come and they did not know how to address the Prophet, peace be upon him. So they would come outside of his home, I think in Surah Hujurat as well. Uh, it, it would come outside of his home and they would start screaming, Muhammad, Muhammad, come out, come out. So they would address him by name, which again, we said there is no hierarchy, but we needed to have a way to address the Prophet, peace be upon him, in a respectful way. So throughout the Quran, you will see Rasulullah. Even in the, uh, in the famous place in Surah Muhammad, God says, Muhammadun Rasulullah. Muhammad, the messenger of Allah. But if I don't mind, and all due respect to the questioner, I, I question back, only one thing, find the four places in the Qur'an where Allah does say Muhammad and find out why and what type of loving tone is being taken in that situation. So it's used fewer times, only four times in the Qur'an is he called by name, but I would implore you and encourage you to find out why he is called by his name and how frequently Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala calls to him in a loving fashion. And this connects directly to Brother Noman's question, why was he? Is there are gems, but at the end of the day, we believe Quran to be from Allah, our Creator. So He chose these scenarios so that we could learn to respect the Prophet, peace be upon him. Uh, on another time, if we could figure out why did he say it at all, it's a very interesting story. There's a lot of uh, love and compassion, and in certain cases, it's us understanding the mentality or the thought process of the Prophet, peace be upon him. I had another question, so if it's okay. Did that answer your question, kind of, sort of? And it looks like a guy's handwriting, so. <laughs> Why is the name so few times? But it's mentioned Rasulullah, Nabi, Ya Ayyuhan Nabi. It's mentioned so many times. And Sheikh Suhaib's not here, so I'm take 20 seconds uh, to answer. God speaks through Quran, right? So He speaks through this text. He also knows that the reader is of different, uh, different states. Um, we just heard someone read Quran in the bathroom, right? Not recommended, not the best thing to do, but hey, if you're on a journey, you're on a journey. You gotta do what you gotta do. But in this, we realize that the Prophet wasallam, when he was receiving Quran or reciting Quran in Surah Kahf, and in many places in the Quran, Abasa wa Tawalla, it is, he's spoken to in a very stern fashion, and, but his thought process comes through. Do you remember what in Surah Kahf when Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said, and it is as if you wanted to take your own life? You guys kind of nod for a second? Okay. Just pretend. It's okay. So yes, so that's the mentality. So when the Prophet, peace be upon him, is addressed by name, there's a mentality that he's receiving and that he is saying and how we should treat him, how we should speak to him. But you will also find that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is very loving and caring with the Prophet, peace be upon him. Did you ever notice in the beginning of Qul Ya Ayyuhal Kafirun? Ya Ayyuhal Kafirun means, O oh, disbelievers. What does it say before that? Qul. Why does God have to encourage him to say it? Because his nature is so soft that he can't walk up to people and be like, hey, disbeliever, infidel. It wasn't in his nature. So the words that were selected in the Qur'an, the words that were selected, were selected to even understand the mezaj, the nature, the nature, the, the mindset, thank you very much, the mindset of the Prophet, peace be upon him.